STIs or sexually transmitted infections can be terrifying. But don't worry, we've got you. In this judgment-free video, we'll explore the most common STIs, their symptoms, and how you can get rid of them or avoid them in the first place. Hi, I'm Cynthia, and welcome to Real Talk with Sticks, where we cover all things sexual, vaginal, and reproductive health. So an STI is a sexually transmitted infection, which can then develop into a sexually transmitted disease, or an STD. And you can get an STI by having unprotected sexual contact with somebody who has an STI, whether or not they have symptoms. There are more than 20 types of STIs, but today we're gonna focus on the top five here in the US. Those are HPV, chlamydia, gonorrhea, HIV, and her Real Talk is the sex ed we all deserve. So make sure to subscribe and turn on those notifications. Let's dive in. The human papilloma virus, also known as HPV, is one of the most common STIs. There are over 40 types of HPV, and you can get HPV through vaginal, oral, or anal sex, in addition to skin-to-skin -to -skin contact. Your body can heal from some forms of HPV on its own, but some types can actually cause further health problems, like genital warts, or in the worst case, cancer. It's critical to stay on top of your HPV status with regular pap smears and to get the HPV vaccine. Also, condoms. They help prevent the transmission of HPV and so many other STIs, which we'll talk about today. And Styx condoms are ultra thin, made without harmful chemicals, fragrance-free, and electronically triple tested because sex should feel good. If you're a student, go to getsticks.com for free condoms and only pay for the shipping. Now, let's talk about chlamydia. Chlamydia is usually spread by vaginal or anal sex, but can also be spread through oral sex. It's a bacteria and is one of the most common STIs in America. Approximately three million people become infected every year. Chlamydia is most common in people under the age of 25. Now, symptoms, if you even experience any, can include things like abnormal vaginal bleeding or discharge, lower abdominal pain, discomfort like pain or burning when you have to pee or when you're trying to have sex. To treat chlamydia, you use antibiotics, and it's critical to make sure that any partners that you've had in the past three months are tested and treated to prevent reinfection and retest after just one to three months just to make sure that infection is gone. If you have these symptoms, it's also good to first check if you have a yeast infection. Symptoms are similar and yeast infections are even more common than chlamydia. But one difference to note is that yeast infections produce thick, white cottage cheese-like discharge, while chlamydia can cause green, white, or yellow discharge. Find out if you're experiencing a yeast infection or a more serious vaginal infection with our at-home pH test with instant results in just two minutes. We're also publishing a ton of videos on yeast infections, so make sure to subscribe so you don't miss them. Gonorrhea has symptoms similar to chlamydia. These include things like discomfort when you pee or have a bowel movement, anal itching, abnormal vaginal bleeding, or abnormal vaginal discharge. And gonorrhea and chlamydia actually often occur at the same time. However, many women don't have symptoms, and in some cases, symptoms don't appear for months. The kicker, symptoms can actually feel like a UTI, meaning it would be a good idea to do a UTI test first to confirm. Like chlamydia, you treat gonorrhea with antibiotics, and it is important that all your sexual partners get tested and treated as well. Our next this video is all about UTIs, the signs, the symptoms, treatments, and so much more, so make sure to subscribe. Herpes is a super common infection, with more than half of Americans having oral herpes, and about one out of every six Americans have genital herpes. Chances are you know a few people living with herpes. You can easily catch genital herpes through skin-to-skin -skin contact, and unfortunately, once you contract genital herpes, you will always have it. However, symptoms or outbreaks can be managed with medication. Symptoms of genital herpes can include painful blisters around the vagina or anus, and sometimes those blisters are actually inside your vagina or anus, where that can't be seen or felt. One way to reduce transmission is condoms. With sticks, you can have condoms delivered straight to your door. By the way, if you have any further questions or topics you want us to cover here in Real Talk, comment below. All right, let's talk about HIV. HIV virus interferes with your body's ability to fight off other diseases, and testing is the only way to diagnose this. This is because early symptoms are so often mistaken with other viruses. These symptoms include things like headache, fatigue, swollen lymph glands, fever, rash, and sore throat. 
that you're highly contagious in those early stages of HIV. And then as HIV continues, it destroys your immune cells. So you become more vulnerable to other types of infections. An HIV diagnosis is not the death sentence that it was back in the 80s and 90s. Most people with HIV can live long and healthy lives if they get on and stay on treatment. HIV does not mean AIDS. AIDS is an immunodeficiency disease. HIV is the virus that can lead to it. And according to HIV.gov in the US, most people with HIV don't develop AIDS because they're taking HIV medication as prescribed to stop the progression of the disease. Now the treatment for HIV is called antiretroviral therapy, or ART, ART. ART involves taking a combination of HIV medicines called an HIV treatment regimen every day. ART is recommended for everybody who has HIV. It can't cure HIV, but these medications can help people with HIV live longer and healthier lives. Practicing safe sex by using condoms can help prevent the spread of this disease. You do you, and we'll make sure you have peace of mind and all the fun with the Sticks Safe Sex Kit. Prevent pregnancy, STIs, and vaginal infections easily and discreetly. Remember, we're here for you with the information, support, and solutions you need right where you are, right when you need it. If you're experiencing some of these symptoms, go to your doctor as soon as possible. We are here to support you in your sexual and vaginal wellness with products that keep your vagina healthy, like easy tests and treatments, probiotics, and a restart morning after pill. Our bodies are nobody's business but our own. That's why we've made it easier than ever to get products quickly shipped to your door in discreet packaging, so you're supported whenever you need it. Plus, get 15% off with the code YouTube, my treat. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, like, and hit that bell. See you in the next class.